God so wants to love him that he wants us to be in it too. And so the Trinity, this infinite outpouring of God, the Trinity opened out and created, but so that he could draw creation into himself. So God created you and me to love us. And then we are to, yeah, we're choosing the gift of this love to give ourselves away. To take our family traits, the traits of God, and pour ourselves out in love. And Jesus comes to find out why. He comes to connect himself to us, to embrace us in love, in an embrace that doesn't end. The deepest love we can possibly experience, and the love that we're all moving towards right here, is the sacrament of what God is like. Marriage points us to God. At this time, it is my great privilege, honor, and joy to present you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Luke and Shannon Fisher. as husband and wife and they picked out a great one. This is Everything Has Changed by Taylor Swift. May your marriage be a reflection of God's love and may your marriage be fruitful with many children. And <laughs> um, to everyone, everyone that you encounter, may your marriage be a reflection of God's love and may you bring that joy and happiness to everyone. Cheers. And I think I have a crush on someone. And I said, oh really, who is it? And she said, it's that guy, Luke, that I was telling you about. And I think he likes me too. And I said, oh, how, what makes you think that he likes you too? And she said, because you know when you're dancing in a room with people and you're looking over at the guy that you like, but you don't want them to see you looking at them? Yeah. And she said, well, we kept doing that to each other the whole time. And so, when a warrior and a another warrior Engage in a marriage together it is custom for the king to propose a toast. I'm just really, I'm really thankful that we have, that, that, that Jesus brought the two of you together. Um, I'm thankful that we have a marriage that just invites other people into it. you there.